everybody, my name's Chris, and welcome back to another exciting episode of Let's Play Life is Strange. Oh, I feel so good to be back in this timeline. Boobs! God dang it, why are there boobs in this game? There can't, I died, no. No. Ah, oh, it's the bluebird! That poor little bird has been trapped in here. Alright, let's save the bird. How do we save bird? Hello, bird. How do we save Joyce bird? Chirp, chirp. Oh, you know, that was a bad idea. Was that bird leading me somewhere? Can we open the window? It's such a warm, beautiful day. Hmm. How could a killer storm just pop oh, up Oh, that's tomorrow? right. That pops up tomorrow. All right, bird. You're welcome. Ski that way. Fly. Be free. Yeah, the Joyce bird has been saved. <gasps> Wait a minute, the birds are all dying though. Okay. Wait. No. No, let's let's keep it open. Let's keep it open. Then maybe Joyce bird can come back and not die. Since David might be in there, I better mosey along for a change. Ah, uh, screw it. Just do it. Just do it! Also, we should really, uh... Look at what our photos are gonna be this, uh, this, uh, there we go. The window. There's a necklace there or something, though. Bird's nest, rock pile, two tails, squirrel tails. A lot of pictures of squirrels in this game. Those footprints in the sand, I would assume. Whale tail, windmill, ha <laughs> ha, skeleton with the skateboard. Uh, but there's a lot of birds in this bird related pictures. One, two, three. Oh, this one probably is. This looks like the, the window we just let the bird out. That's why I thought, oh, that's wrong way. Let's go downstairs. We saved a bird bird's life. Bird, 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 bird. I'm sorry, David. I know you probably mean well, but you're still a dick. You won this battle, Max. You broke up my family. I salute you. David, I didn't try to hurt you. Ever. But I won't let anybody hurt Chloe. Oh, he thinks he's doing Too the much. right thing. Henry, you just better be damn careful with her. Don't you wander off into the dark. Bye! <laughs> I helped Joyce lose William, and now David. Oh, what's up? What's up, Warren? Yo, yo, Max! Friend Chloe texted me and that I'm out that I'm out of the loop now. She sounds hot, so I get why. Chloe actually texted you? I sure didn't have her number. At least I still get to go ape with you unless you want to chill with Chloe, or it could all go. One pain in the ass is enough, cool. I have the jet, talk to you later. Silly. All right, all right. David isn't any different from me when he's looking at those family photos. Uh huh. Yep. Is there a Joyce in here? No, she's gonna be at the restaurant. She. Oh boy, what is this? Those poor whales are like uh -huh. angels. What is going on here? Uh -huh. So in this reality that happened, I thought that was maybe just the old reality. There's a Looks change like jar. Back on the road to Paris. Yay. This note. Ouch. Oh, from David, I bet. David, do not be here when I get back from work. I mean it. No. Wish I would have put that freaking. Ah, God dang it. To think this all started with my vision of a tornado. The crane bay is now. Um, well, uh, Kate, if uh, a cold apocalypse now, while uh, Katie Katie Abreu is now considered a quaint fishing intern. Oh, is this the same thing? Here's Bay Strange Weather is being studied. Prominent state is national scientists, apparently including NASA. Holy crap. What's even more incredible is that these eco phenomena is the fact that not a single meteorologist has offered any actual theory or even reason for uh, for this atmosphere havoc. Okay. There's the dead flowers. Oh no! Oh my god. All I'm trying to do is god dang freaking press the shift button to run it's right above so background upset. 
Are you helping anybody, Max? Yeah, of course. It's gonna come on eventually. He's freaking spying on everybody. God dang. There's dead birds. Dead borts. Dead borts. What, what's my mission right now? I don't remember. What, oh, it's supposed to be going in the garage, I think. Look. What's this? William never finished painting that wall. Oh. Poor Joyce. She's been getting bad luck. Oh, yeah, the, the dead dog. Hmm. All right. Hello, birds. Poor birds. I guess <coughs> David wasn't in the mood to clean up. Hmm. Got anything else here? Doubt it. All right, let's go back inside. For a second, I thought I was stuck outside because I didn't see an option pop up. There we go. Okay, it's going to the garage. In the parking garage. It looks like David finished his car repairs. Maybe there's some new clues around. I know. Why is there lockers in here? That's weird. They could be stupid to do that after we pretty much told them that we were Should looking through his crap. Petition? Blackwell sure isn't safe and private anymore. Okay, Manson, despite, despite our rather heated discussion about the successful petition, the Block Campus Surveillance System, I'm still interested in your feedback on other methods of employing Blackwell security. We must find middle ground between safety and privacy for our students. Best principle was. Oh, works. meow, Miss Grant. Twist that knife. I didn't need a surveillance camera to see this suspension coming. Best of luck to you, Ms. Grant. Oh, I see. Good lord. At least he has one weird fan. Uh, from Anonymous, dear Miss Madsen, I just want you to know that I think it's bullshit what happened to you and the school has too many libtard metrosexuals who don't appreciate you or the military. I felt safe in my dorm when you were in charge and I thought about you protecting me. I hope you'll come back to Blackwell and make sure we are all all safe at night. I'm scared for the school. Scared. I'm scared of the school. I wonder. This might be Nathan, to be honest. Wish I had surveillance footage of that conversation. Apologized. Um, from David to Raymond. I apologize for my outburst. Wells. I forget what that is. In your oh, Principal Wells. I bet. Right. That was that's the principal. Yes, it is. Apologize for my outburst oh. yesterday in your office. I, God damn it, Skype. I. I was upset about losing my position at Blackwell without a complete investigation of the fact that, in fact, it's based solely on claims of untrustworthy students. There is a, there is a cancer at Blackwell Academy, and without me, it will continue to spread. Seriously, Madsen D. There's the map. There's the map. Cameras at Pan Estates. David must be working for the Prescotts too. Hmm. Interesting. That's where Joyce is. Wait, no, she doesn't work there in this time. That's right. Oh, I'm an idiot. You are an idiot. William stuff. Oh, that makes me sad. It was so incredible to see William again. I wish Chloe could too. Yeah, that's so sad. This. What the hell did David do for Nathan? And what did his dad do for David? I can't read this. Mr. Madsen, thank you for your help with Nathan. It's so appreciated. Best Sean Prescott. Make powerful friends. Either Chloe stole another gun, or David is out there armed. Probably he's out there armed. Oh, jeez. Oh, okay. David is packing up wedding stuff, too. I'm not really surprised. Pair ball. There's more to David Madsen than meets the eye. He should finish this letter to Joyce. Joyce, you know I'm not going to explain myself or why I act the way I do sometimes. All I know that nobody has ever... Understood me more than me the way you do. I would never do anything to hurt you or Chloe. Taking care of my family is my number one mission. Yes, I overstepped my bonds of surveillance and suspicion. And I'm truly sorry and ashamed. But there are dark things happening in Arcadia Bay. I've never told you. You are my wife and partner, and I know we should have no secrets. I intended to tell you every everything, but I wanted more proof. Instead, a student committed suicide on my watch. You kicked me out of my favorite home, and my stepdaughter hates me. Please let me... Aww... I wish I could take that and leave it somewhere for Joyce to find. Maybe she will. I doubt she will, actually. I highly doubt she will. Alright, I'm guessing there's going to be something where the car used to be. The car was covering it up, but we couldn't find it. But now we can. 
It's Chloe's truck. Can, does Joyce have a vehicle, I wonder? Whoa, that is a serious padlock on that locker. Hey, David, what you hiding? What you hiding? Oh, boy. Oh, Shit. boy. For don't once, know. I don't have time to search for the code. How am I going to do this? Oh, I need to find a way to break this padlock. I don't have time. You left. I'm gonna break the dang pad. Do I have to build another bomb? Um. What is it? Well, that's a fire. David is going to the party. In the world party. What the heck? Let's shoot it. Shoot it with a gun. Aha! Crowbar. Okay. I can use that crowbar to pry open the locker. And then reverse time. Wonderful. Who wonderful? Who oh boy? Crowbar. Sorry, David, but I bet you would do the same thing as me. Yeah, I don't feel well. Yeah, actually, that probably will work. Let's say like that's a pretty powerful padlock, but you don't really need to break the padlock. You just need to break the the thing the padlock oh, attaches maps, it. Notes, coordinates, photos of Kate, Nathan. Oh boy. Oh, yes. Uh, Black girl can't parking. She knows something. What does she know? Jesus. Twin Peaks. Oh boy. Some take pictures. Okay. Whose truck is that? I can't read that. <coughs> <coughs> Art. It looks like Rachel almost. M E. Pay up. Hmm. We reverse time. Back to Chloe now. Why don't we reverse time? Have it so that's fixed. That way we can literally just take things that in and out and never have to worry about getting caught. What's this? Looks like David already booked a room. The the Blotch Hotel. Let me see. I see uh huh uh huh uh huh. Yo, uh -huh. Chloe! Are you ready yet? For a second, I was like, "Oh no, she can't get down the stairs. She's paralyzed." Very happy. I hit the secret file jackpot. Kate, Nathan, and Rachel, plus some location coordinates. David is like a one-man surveillance army. Now let's get the hell out of here before we get busted. Maybe I should reverse I time and fix all the things. We have to be <clears throat> extra careful. Max. No worries, I've you on Paris. Prescott to be afraid of us. Yay! Let's get out of here! Get out of here! Shoo! Shoes! There's Mr. Teacher. Oh, look, they're playing football. Is this just like a thing they do every day? Everything's back to normal. No, this school does not do a very good job of cleaning up the graffiti. Oh, it's a janitor. What's his name? I can't remember his dang name. Hey, Max. How you doing? Oh, hi, Mr. Jefferson. I'm okay. Um, and this is my friend, Chloe. Yeah. I wonder if he knows her. Chloe? Why isn't somebody as cool as you <laughs> Blackwell? I was way too Hello. cool for the school. It's a long story. And actual files here. I can imagine. <laughs> Max, are you sure that you're all right? It's weird just being on campus like everything's normal. I know. Lame as it sounds, life has to go on. I think so there's lame. too much going on in my life. On that note, just unload. Blackwell duty calls. Remember, I'm going to announce the winner of the Everyday Heroes contest tonight at the party. So I hope you'll be there to celebrate. Did I ever enter? I'm sorry you didn't enter a photo. I was there? Your reasons. Was there an option to enter? An artist to work. Was there? I feel like a total did I miss? Reason, it's been a hard week to focus. I feel like I had an I'm option to enter it. I'm proud of you for caring so much about a troubled friend, and I take hope in the fact that you have plenty of time to find your way. Just get in the habit of putting your work out there. Thanks, Mr. Jefferson. Good lord. I'll definitely be there tonight. Me too. I'll be Max's date. You better dance with us at least once. <laughs> Nobody should have to see me dance. Plus, I don't want to watch the old hipster trying to keep up with the kids. I have some pride. 
be seeing you. Yes, you will. Huh? She, does she yeah, find him cute? Gross. There you go. <laughs> out of control. Not yet. Just wait until the rager tonight. <sighs> Shut up. Don't be jealous because Mark Jefferson thinks I'm cool. I am so ignoring you. Fine. Since I'm here, I'll see if I can get some dirt from Justin. I haven't talked to him in a while. Now that is a great plan. All right. <clears throat> Let's go uh, mess a boot. I was just gonna save Kate. Let's see if I can find out where Nathan is. Nope, I don't want to go nope. there. See where Nathan is. Something. I cut that off. I just wanted to see if I could, you know, see anything. Oh, there's a wall. Did you know there was a wall just beyond this hill? That's kind of interesting. Principal Wells was so loaded the other night <laughs> here. Yup, yup. Right. What do we want to do first? Sorry, I'm just kind of jerking around the camera a little bit too much here. Poor Daniel. Looks like he needs a hug. Hey, Poor Daniel. guy. You look bummed out. Are you all right? Probably well, not. I just figured out that my photos basically suck. I'm a wannabe artist. You're an idiot. <laughs> yeah, I love your drawings. You're not here to be a photographer. That's my gig. Look at that sketch you did of me. Incredible. And that's your art. Your gift. Yeah. Oh, I do feel better now. You are good, Max. Oh, bees, run! Let's talk about Kate. Have you talked to anybody about what happened with Kate? I don't talk to anybody, Max. <laughs> but, oh, I did actually have a conversation with Brooke. She was very sad about Kate. Who's skateboarding? So am Stop I. freaking Chloe. And angry. Chloe we gets distracted. Stop going to class and stage a protest. Uh, but it's <laughs> not going to happen at Blackwell. Yet. I like this revolutionary Daniel DaCosta. Only if I hmm. can start the revolution from my sketchbook. Oh, <laughs> look at that shirt! Oh my god, I didn't notice the shirt! <laughs> oh, my lady. Oh, oh, that's great. Have you seen Nathan Prescott? Oh, I heard a rumor he's actually suspended. Yeah, but he's still gotta be on campus. That explains why he looked so yeah. pissed off when I saw him leaving campus a few moments ago. Oh, he left campus, Are you going eh? To the world party tonight? It will be if I go, man. People here push me into lockers, not dance floors. Aw, I should come. Sure. That's exactly why you should go to that party. We have to stand up to these Blackwell bullies for Kate. You won't be alone, Daniel. Not with yeah, you. Yeah, just all get in a oh, fight at it. the thing. I will go to the party like it is the end of the world. Kind of is, okay, be honest. I won't go, but <laughs> I won't do that, but I'll go. Let's talk. <laughs> okay, Daniel. Good. Nathan uh, is not around. I should go back to Chloe. I don't want to figure out that quick. Oh, there's Chloe there. Justin, What's up, bro? It's so oh, long since I've seen you. Because you're way too cool for us now, Chloe. <laughs> way too much shit going on, man. Try going to Blackwell. You're insane. So I hear. Any word at all on Rachel? Dude, I wish. I'm working on <laughs> it. Oh, I miss her laugh. When I bail off my board. She is probably high. Yeah. She had the <laughs> sick nugs. True that. Okay, the sick nugs. Come hang with us at the park sometime. <laughs> That's funny. What's up, bro? What's up? What's up, bro? I like saying what's up, bro, a lot. It makes me feel happy. Enjoy the big game, Zachary. I hope it's not the last. Me, seven. Uh Let's photograph it. I think I missed the picture already. A little window with a necklace. For posterity. Yay. <coughs> <coughs> Excuse me. Okay, where it. did these rocks come from? This is too blurry. Oh, yeah, those weren't there. Those weren't there before. I wonder if there's anything buried beneath. That's so ironic that Warren asked Max to the drive-in. Oh, she's talking to someone. Hey, right, Joan. Forgot about that. Brooke doesn't look happy that I'm going ape with Warren. Sorry. Hey, how are you? Considering what happened to Kate, I could be better. Are oh. you okay? Okay, she's not mad at me. I might feel better taking your drone. <laughs> I didn't run. I didn't. Miss Grant finally gave up and let me fly her again. But Yay. you're going to the drive-in with Warren, so you don't have time to fly my drone. Really? 
I can't fly your drone because I'm going to see ape movies with Warren? You are perceptive, Max. Now, excuse me. My drone needs me. I'm not going out there to date him. God. Jeez. Confirmed for hated. We need to end off this episode. Uh, Samuel, there we go. Sad. Makes me mad. Climate change isn't real my ass. I think everything is changing here. As a scientist, the I'm fascinated. As Michelle Grant, what? I'm very worried. Arcadia Bay is scared Where? Too. Look at the weather. And the animals. Not to what was mention the noise? Oh, there it is. We all need to look out for each other these days. Is that it? Let's take a look That's at him. It's cool to see that Samuel's not alone for once. Yeah, that is nice. Mrs. Grant looks interested in whatever Samuel is saying. So I'll talk to him in the next episode because we are kind of at the end of the episode here. My sweet Kate. What's she gonna say, Trevor? What's this oh, say? Oh, great! Chloe stole money from the handicapped access fund. <sighs> We're going to hell. What? Just so like. Donator's supervision. Start. What? Donator's supervision? What is this? Accessibility upgrades? Oh, I see. For wheelchair people. Okay, okay. So, well, you know. Samuel misses his squirrels. Aw, poor Samuel. Thanks for watching, everybody. If you enjoyed, the best way to support me is by leaving a like and subscribing to my channel if you haven't already. I'm going to read the journal. So, if you don't care about that, then bring it. Screw off! I'm just kidding. Dang, I missed a lot of pictures. Um, there we go. I've never been so glad to see Chloe in my life. The second I saw her blue hair and that beautiful pissed off face, I would have kissed her again. And I couldn't even tell her where I had been or why. It would be one more thing to alienate Chloe from me and the world. I had to get refocused and for, for, blah, blah, blah. on our search for Rachel. Chloe had been busy with her detective work while I was in my alternate timeline. Of course, it was much easier for me to explore David's garage since Joyce had booted his ass out. I made Chloe more content than... I've just about seen her since I returned. I still kind of feel bad for David, but he overstepped his authority. I agree with that. Dismissed. And it's not so uh, so much easier to grab David's X-Files when he's not there. After we got our new info, like Halloween treats, I loved watching Chloe go into Sherlock mode while examining all of her clues on the big old drawing board. Of course, we all know that she's more of a Dr. Watson, right? Elementary. Honestly, with all the impending doom and sadness, I felt so happy. Just to find myself back in the action with my best friend or a butterfly blue hair. Hella yes. Oh, weird. Never seen all these pages before without uh, the text on it. Aww, is this a page just dedicated to the young them and then William? That's cute. I kind of hope this page remains blank. That's, aww, that's sad. Thanks for watching, everyone. I'll talk to you guys next time. Bye.